I could just get your attention, please, for, for just three minutes. Number one, the Muslim vote has now made history in America. We now see the Muslim vote making a change starting from Michigan and spreading throughout the country. So let us thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for giving us that power that we can tip the balance now in any election. Number, number two, we will decline any invitation from any politician who comes to, to us on this election year. We will deny that invitation if they deny bread to the oppressed. If they weaponize food and they continue the systematic decimation of our people or any oppressed people, whether in Palestine or the Sudan or the Uyghurs or the Rohingya or anywhere in the world, if they deny bread to the homeless here, we will deny them. And number three, this is now the beginning of a new struggle of nonviolent resistance. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has given us power through our wealth, through our accessibility and our freedoms here. So use that power effectively by our vote. Go to the table. If you're not registered, register. If you are, take one and give it to somebody who's not registered. Let us organize the Muslim vote here. As Dr. Saleh said, over 100 cities have voted for a ceasefire. We may not care about the presidency, but we will care about the people starting with our own city and vote for those who vote for justice. So, let us leave with the words of the Quran that tell us, let us leave with the words of the Quran that tell us, خِفَافًا وَثِقَالًا وَجَاهِدُوا بِأَمْوَالِكُمْ وَأَنفُسِكُمْ فِي سَبِيلِ اللَّهِ ذَلِكُمْ خَيْرٌ لَكُمْ إِن كُنْتُمْ تَعْلَمُونَ Continue to march on. We march in the protest. March to the voting booths now. Whether it is a light burden or a heavy burden, strive with yourselves and your wealth. That is the best for you if you only knew. So please, Thank the workers who are giving us the voter registration booth. Thank the workers of this convention center and take a voter registration form now and fill it, please. Thank you. Salaam alaikum.